हेलो टीम गुड मॉर्निंग एंड गुड इवनिंग ऑल वेलकम टू आवर मेन फ्रेम क्लास सो वी ऑलरेडी कवर एस एम पी बेसिक टॉपिक्स इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू ए स्टार्ट सम ओवरव्यू कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ एस एम पी एंड वी अंडरस्टैंड वट इज द रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन द एस एम पी जोन एंड लाइब्रेरीज एंड हाउ द एस एम पी वर्क सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विथ टूडेज टॉपिक so in smp overview we already cover the small topics like what is dlib tlib sysmod in sysmod we covered ptf apr function user mode and uh, all the zone we covered global zone target zone distribution zone so let's uh, combine all these topics in a one slide so you already know smp means like smp stands for system modification program extended so smp is a tool uh, designed to manage the installation of software product on the geo system and to track the modification so the individual component uh, we talk in mvs so whether they can be assemble like a micros uh, source uh, linked it and uh, system code or jcl or other elements so all are distributed to the customer in individual partition data set or we call as a library so all these are called the distribution library so member of distribution library can be pictured as the building uh, building like a box here building like a bricks we called as a bricks like that and uh, in left side of the visual is a supported to give you an idea of how smp nowadays keep the install logic information and smp holds the metadata about the system so called zone which is turned or a part of consolidated software inventory or we called as like a csi data set and the system comes into the being a target and distribution data set consequently and the smp itself is also separated into the target and distribution zone that we call the dlib and uh, the global zone above the target zone uh, and uh, dlib serve the smp administrative task and has no direct system relation between them so this is the overview of smp next topic is the relationship between the smp zones and the libraries so first we need to understand what is the smp so we previous video we already covered what is the smp so smp is the tool to manage the software installation and modification on the geo system and uh, when we talk about the library so we have the two libraries uh, tlib and dlib so net, ne next we need to understand what is the relationship between the zones so here you saw you see like it's a csi data set so csi is the consolidated software inventory so it's a data set used to track the status and content of the system software including all the libraries so we have a uh, three zones first we have a global zone next we have a target zone and third we have a distribution zone so what is the global zone so global zone contains the information about the sysmod sysmods that means the system modification packages and their relationship between the serving as a central repository of the software changes next we have the target zone so target zone records the information about the status structure of the operating system libraries which contains the executable code needed to run the system and last one is the distribution zone so in distribution zone contains the libraries which contains the master copy of all the component of the operating system next we have the library so we have a two library target library and distributed library so target library contains the executable code that your system runs example production or test system libraries next we have the distribution library or we called as the dlib so it's contain the master copy of each element for the system used as a input for the system generation and the backup 
so next day in our mind it's coming like what is how its zone and the libraries are interact between each other so smp uses the information in the csi data sets to determine which library should contain which elements and to identify which system util utilities should be called the installation when smp process the sysmod it install the element in the appropriate libraries and update its own record of the processing it has been done so this contain of each set of the libraries like it's uh, maybe csi zone it's a contact with the libraries tlib and the dlib so when we speak uh, exception data so we usually refer to the whole data so whole data is often supplied for the product to indicate uh, specific sysmod should be held from the installation so what is the reason for holding a sysmod so there were some reason first is the uh, error hold so what is the error hold so a ptf is in a error and should not be installed until the error is corrected at that time error hold occurred next we have the system hold so certain system action might be required before the sysmod installation so we called as the system hold next we have the user hold so a user hold might want to perform uh, some action before the installing installing the sysmod at that time user hold needed so now you can see how the elements of the system fit together and how they can use to install modified and track the using the smp so our next topic is how does smp works so it uh, contains the information about the structure content and the modification status of the software so in which first we need to understand what is the distribution library so distribution library contains all the elements such as uh, modules and macros that are used as the input for running your system so once the very important use of distribution library is for the backup so is there any serious uh, error occurred with the element on the production system the element can be replaced by a stable label found in the distribution libraries only next we have the target library so target library contains the executive executable code needed to run on the system next we have the csi that means the consolidated software inventory it contains the information about the structure of geo system so the csi contains the entries for elements in the distribution and target libraries and uh, grouped into the zones so we have a distribution zone target zone and a global zone so global zone contains entries uh, that needed to identify and describe each target uh, and distribution zone to smp also it collect the information about the smp processing options it has the status information for all the sysmods in the smp and uh, system programmer can also use the csi data set to obtain the latest information on the structure contained and the status of the system so it's uh, provide uh, the information and report listing the dialog which help you to install the system so that's all for today's thank you all uh, please like share and subscribe this channel if you have any doubt please mention in the comment box so thank you again bye